edit. Jay, terrific job on this. And I wanted to ask you, I mean, you don't see a lot of comedic tennis films. So where'd that come from? <laughs> we, uh, we all keep saying this is uh, one of the best uh, sports comedies in years and the best tennis film ever, because uh, there just aren't that many. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. So when you read the script, though, what was it about it that you thought, wow, you know, this is really going to work? I had been searching for years for my first feature film to direct, and when I read the script, it really hit on all the touch, uh, touchstones I was looking for. It was funny, it was irreverent, it was dark, it had drama, um, it had heart, it had tenderness. It really just had the, this incredible mix of, of emotions and themes and, uh, and tone in terms of you know, dark to light. There were you know, funny jokes betwixt and between you know, dark family moments. And, um, that was exactly what I was looking for. Yeah, and then Jeremy and David. I mean, you can't buy chemistry like that, can you? You cannot find, uh, it, it's very difficult to find people who play siblings, and that was one of the challenges. Jeremy was already a part of the film when I came on board, and that was something I was really excited about. And uh, one of the big challenges was figuring out who was going to play his brother. And, uh, you know, I, we poured through just lists and lists of names and and really dug very deep and when David's name came up he came in and auditioned and he just crushed it and it, we knew instantly we all knew instantly yeah. that he was Darren yeah and then yeah. how difficult was it for you shooting the tennis stuff because that well you know that's got to be difficult I would think or not shooting the tennis was the most <laughs> arduous part of shooting the film I do a lot of episodic television we move very quickly and I can get through stuff really fast and um, the, the, the general scene work, all the funny scenes were, were easy, the you know sort of darker scenes were relatively easy as well, just we had great actors, and the tennis was just really, really hard. Um, you know, it, it's something that you have to figure out how to do, like I never shot a tennis movie before, so you had to devise, uh, you know, I had to devise a system of how to shoot it, and what I did was I developed a visual arc for it where when we first meet Jimmy, he's reckless and he's out of sorts and the camera work is handheld and it's very loose. And when you first meet Darren, he's sort of stoic and everything's stayed and static and he's conservative. And as the brothers get together and, and as their personal story and their relationship goes up and down, the style of the camera work became more polished or not, depending on what was happening, kind of building to you know the, the polish that we had in the final act. So it was, it was very carefully designed. and. We shot for 24 days, and probably six of it was, was tennis. Wow. Well, it looked yeah. great, I have to say. It was Thank fun watching you. those matches. Um, you know, not that you don't have some great people in this. I mean, not to mention, you know, J.K. Simmons and everything. But the little kid, I mean, that Joshua Rush, oh, my goodness. I remember watching him in Parental Guidance, and I thought, yeah. this kid broke my heart in that movie. He is fantastic. I mean, did he surprise you when you started to work with him? He, Joshua Rush is an amazing little kid. He, he's not so little anymore, but uh, he's like the, an 80-year-old actor in the body of a 12-year-old. He's really an old soul um, and just really has a, a sharp adult understanding of dark dramatic themes and humor. And we knew from his audition and his callback that he was Barry. There was no question. He came in with a, his pants pulled up high and a belt and a super bacon superhero t-shirt tucked in. and. Like, oh my God, that's Barry. And, but then on set, just his capacity for, it wasn't like I had to figure out how to get a good take out of him and then hopefully I got one or two that could work. Like every take he came in from take one, it just worked and I was just able to get options and he was, he was just a great, great actor. I love him to death. Yeah, he's the heart of the film. There's no yeah. question about it. Well, congratulations on this. Great job. And uh, I look forward to lots more.